you guys good morning it's your girl crystal renee so it is friday black friday so i got out here they're expecting a little bit of rain and then they're saying the temperature is going to drop into the 50s tonight yay high temp of 71 i love it hey guys good morning so i'm trying something new on the advice of one of my friends so instead of sitting in my regular spots in my regular working area i decided to sit out here at the airport so they got a travel plaza sit up as a parking lot there's a store there's a bathroom so it's okay we can sit over here now hopefully we'll get a good ride but i was just catching up on the news um and it looks like a florida man because they're either Florida man or Florida woman. <laughs> um, but a Florida man. I'm not sure what area. I missed it. Um, but this fool. He. Stabbed his. Mother. Uh, the mother of his child. The child was 10 months old. And she had. Two small kids. Four and five. But this man. He stabbed this woman to death. And then set the apartment on fire. Killed the 10 month old baby that was inside the house and the four and five year old child are now in critical condition being intubated. Um, but it looks like right now they are gonna survive. And this right here just and unfortunately, it looks like he's black. The name the name sounds black. They didn't show a picture of him, but the name sounds black. But random thought. This makes me so furious. You know, um, they're talking about... It, it is narcissism. You know, because these men, they're so selfish. I don't know if it's desperation what it is but these I don't understand why these men because it's not it's not many women but I, I understand there there are women that do this too you get obsessed you know you can't let go and I don't understand why there's got to be so much destruction and you got to kill people just walk away you know and when you meet ladies when you're out there and you're meeting these men understand when you meet them that first day those first couple dates you're meeting the representative you know you're actually meeting the representative and it takes some time it takes some time to actually get to know a person to try to actually see who they are you know as they say 90 days Sometimes it's not 90 days because some of these guys, they can play the game. <laughs> they can play the game. And I feel like 90 days is too long to be spending time with somebody trying to figure their asses out. You know, the first red flag that you see, you need to go and go quickly. Um, it's, just, it's, just, it's insane. You can lose your life with these fools. Oh, my God. This woman and her babies, and the stories go on and on and on. This is devastating. <laughs> it's like happy Thanksgiving. Happy start to the holidays. Jeez. My heart goes out to that family those poor kids yeah <laughs> the ping hasn't gone off yeah I don't know how I don't know how long I'm gonna sit here because I don't have the patience normally I would already be on the highway and headed back down the road but I'm gonna sit here um because hopefully I can get me a ride going back over there but my goal is 10 rides um the $200 and I've been sitting here thinking as I was driving because, like I told y'all before, I want to do the Uber trivia. So, 
I just had a neat idea. Cause what I'm gonna do? Cause like I always want to do ten rides. So I think I need to ch randomly pick which ride. So whether it's one, six, eight, um, I need I need to figure out which ride I'm going to play the game with. And then of course I need to start coming up with the the questions um, for the trivia. But then I was also thinking too I could give the writer the option to either tell me a funny story um or something crazy you know and then i can share it with you guys um but yeah i'm just trying to figure out how i'm gonna do this but we're gonna do the uber trivia starting real soon to be honest we don't start doing that I know one question I want to ask. This is a stumper for me, and I need to look up, look up and find out the answer. Um, but what's the two components of an air conditioner? I know one answer. What's the second one? Put it put it in the comments below. <laughs> the two components of an air conditioner. What are they? I know one. What's the second one? All right, I'm going to go. And I'll chat with you guys in a little while. Ciao. Um, after 20 years of marriage and thinking about the red flags, um, when I was dating my ex, um, we lived in different cities. So I was actually driving six hours one way to go and see his butt you know on the weekends so six hours one way um so that's 12 hours because i gotta drive that one way drive the other way back you know and it was so funny after all the years of us being together i would laugh and joke when some people would ask me what was the secret um i would tell them if i would have knew then then when i was driving those 12 hours what I knew now, presently, but we're divorced now. Um, I would have drove in the other direction. <laughs> if I would have knew then, would I knew fast forward, we would have drove in the other direction. Shit. Red flag. <laughs> Some of these men are like that little fuzzy toy, Gizmo. You throw some water on their ass and then they turn into a gosh darn freaking gremlin. <laughs> this shopping area is a freaking zoo. There are, the, the parking lot is full and the patrons, the customers are parking outside on the grass. I can't do it. Ain't no way in hell. Can't do it. So I got an Uber rant. So I just picked up, dropped off a passenger over here at the outlets. And it was three of them. And one of the guys came up here and sat next to me in my little space right here. And his ass... <laughs> He decided to cough in my car and he didn't even attempt to cover his mouth. I'm like sitting here like I'm over here he coughed and then I'm trying to like get out the car like help me. I rolled down the window and I'm just I'm just trying to breathe some fresh air. Cover your mouth. When you're riding in somebody's car, COVID is still out there. Now I want my mask. Damn. I just had a passenger. I begrudgingly, you know how I am, you guys. I took a $4.57 ride. The customer was going 2.6 miles and she had the nerve to pick Uber Share. So Uber got this new program now where you can have a ride 
And if there's another person along the route, if I'm thinking correctly, then that person can select to ride. And I want to say the passenger that's in the car already, they'll get to share the total fare um, for the ride. I think that's how it works. I'm not sure. But she's going 2.6 miles. The total cost of the fare is $4.71. And she's going to pick Uber share. No one no one else got in the car. You know, but talk about cheap asses. <laughs> cheap asses. Hey, you guys. So, I've completed six rides for $60. dollars <laughs> pretty pathetic day they try to have me out here all day mess around trying to get to this two hundred dollars oh my god they are so funny it's not funny shit i was dropping off at the airport and i swear these daggone freaking uber drivers they i get it the airport is very busy and we're trying to drop off passengers but some of those idiots i mean they will literally it could be it's a two-lane road heading to the airport some of those dumb asses are so impatient to drop the customer off at the curb, they will stop right there in the lane of traffic to um, drop their passenger off, which is absolutely freaking ridiculous. So, so I actually missed a couple of requests, I'm assuming, um, from Uber at the airport um, to go wherever. Um, and the one I did see, they wanted me to go to Port Canaveral for $30, 42 mile trip. And I was like, no. So then their asses, <laughs> they got mad. Normally they'll ask me, do I want to stay online? And they'll, they'll close me out and they'll ask me, do I want to stay online? And then I'll answer yes and I'll go back online. These frickers, they actually signed my ass all the way out of the freaking app. Just, just signed me out. I had to get a code to log back in, and then I had to reselect my car as if it was my first time driving <laughs> today. They are just ridiculous. But you know what? I could be just as petty. I sure can. I could be just as petty. I'm, I'm back here on damn. International Drive. So I'll get, get back on here later. Ciao.